Hey guys, so today we're making some chickpea kale and tomato soup. Please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. Let's get started with the recipe. So I'm making another HelloFresh meal today. And so this is a one pot meal and I thought I would show you guys what it's supposed to look like. So let's open the bag and see what we got. So we have one ciabatta roll and the bag, uh, that I get like the meal kit that I get is supposed to be like two servings and so um, we got some kale some Parmesan cheese some Tuscan heat spice I'm not sure what's in that uh, some carrots we have one yellow onion some diced tomatoes um, some chickpeas we got some Israeli couscous I've, I think they put this in their their uh, a lot of their meals then we got some vegetable bouillon, um, some mushroom bouillon. They got a, a package of garlic powder in here. And then there's going to be one garlic clove. And so it says it's for two servings, but it's more like you can get a couple of servings out of this. So I thought it was pretty decent if it's supposed to be two servings. And so I just peeled and chopped my carrots. And then I'm going to do the same thing for the rest of my vegetables I did end up adding another carrot because I felt like this wasn't enough for one big pot of soup so I did add a carrot that I had in my refrigerator and so you can make these whatever size you want but you do want them to cook pretty evenly and then I'm just chopping up that clove of garlic and so now we're gonna saute um, these vegetables just until they are tender it does take the carrots um, a little bit to to get tender so I uh, cook those for about seven minutes maybe and now I'm gonna season my food and you can use whatever seasonings you want just make sure your food is not bland we don't want no bland food y'all and so I know it came with the seasoning pack in the the bag I'm gonna use that but you want to make sure you add some other seasonings to it as well I mean again we don't want no bland food so I'm adding in the seasonings that they, that they provided. And um, they said to only put half of the garlic pack in there. And so now I'm adding in the chickpeas and the liquid that's in there is from the chickpeas. They said don't drain it, but I think it would be fine if you wanted to drain and rinse your chickpeas. And then I'm adding in the tomatoes and I am just gonna give that a stir. Next, I'm going to add in the vegetable bouillon as well as the mushroom bouillon. And this was a really flavorful soup, guys. Um, nice vegetarian option. Nice vegan option. And, you know, I live in the Midwest and <laughs> we don't know what season this is. It's supposed to be spring, but today is winter. The other day it was summer, so I don't know. But this is a nice pot of soup for a nice rainy chilly cold day like it is today over here in the midwest and so again season your food to your taste and make sure you taste as you go and so now um i'm adding in the israeli couscous i did add some water to the other ingredients and then um i'm adding in the kale and I'm just gonna put the lid on it and wait for the kale to get tender. And that's really simple, guys. It was super easy to make. And so now I'm gonna toast up the ciabatta bread. And so I have some butter and I'm just putting some seasoning in my butter. Cause again, we wanna season every layer of our food. I, I promise you, I'm not coming to your house to eat if you don't season your food. And so I probably put too much butter on this, but it was really delicious and buttery and it complemented the soup very well. And so I browned it on both sides. And now the finishing touches to the soup, I'm just adding in the Parmesan cheese. You don't have to do that if you don't want to, but it does add a nice salty taste to the soup. And now I'm just slicing up my bread and I'm about to plate this soup up. Soup, not plate it up, but I'm about to put it in a bowl. Um, and that's it. This is the finished product, you guys nice hot bowl of soup on a nice chilly day i hope you enjoy this recipe please make sure you you like share comment and subscribe bye